This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. Okay, good morning everyone. We're continuing in Mishnah Bura, Daf Hashvah. We're learning Simen Mem Beis. Seif Beis. Im Hisna Aleim Etchila. If one stipulated on the Tefillin initially, Afilu Levashan Adam, even if somebody who did wear them, Yachal Hashan Oisam, you could change them, Afilu Mishal Roish, we just learned in Sefal, if you can't change Shal Rosh Shetol Shal Yad because you can't downgrade in Kedusha, the Mechaber also said that's only if it was worn, but if it was just designated, you could, you could downgrade it because Hazman Alav Nosahi. But if you wear it and you stipulate they should be able to change, you have control, you're able to do that. It says Mishra Be'es Asiyas HaShal Rosh. At the time you made the shorish, afim lo hista rakim yitzurch lasis menu shayad yet shayasa mahaniya tonight. Even if you only stipulated, only that if you have to, that if you need to make a shayad, that you can mahaniya tonight. That tonight helps the chol shekinu omer sheino oisa shorish el lefisha de mahani. Certainly, if you say I'm only making it as a shorish temporarily, that that stipulation helps. Loy mi boy, where. You say you're only making temporarily, but even if you stipulate, if I need to make it until Shalyad, you can, that works. Sif Gimel. Sudar de Azmne Lemeitzer Beit Tefillin. A handkerchief that you designate to wrap Tefillin. La Oilam, forever. Vitzar Beit Tefillin, and you wrap Tefillin. Chad Zimna, one time. Asr Lemeitzer Beit Zuzay. You can use as a wallet. So here, this is the. Based on the Gemara and Brachos, Daf Chav Gimel, Sanhedrin Mem Ches, that if you're Mazmin, and again you have to be Mazmin it forever, and you use it one time, so then it has kedusha, and you can't use it for another item. Says the Mishnah Bura Sivkatan Tes Sudar, Vo Adinim Asa Kis Mechadash Letzarech Tefillin. Likewise, not only a handkerchief, if you make a new pouch. For tefillin. So it's not you're taking an item that was um, used for something else where it requires designation and using. But even if you made something for tefillin, it's not usr, meaning the, the din that has manala milsa is not, only, is not only if you take an item used for a different purpose. Even if you made an item for the tefillin, has manala milsa here. Gamkin ain't also established by Chayel, add the tsarba until you wrap with it. The has manala milsa here. Designation is not significant. Vuadin bechol tashmishe kedusha. Likewise, for all tashmishe kedusha, a filo tik, let's say for Torah, even a container for a safer Torah. But the tashmish, the tashmish. Ain by kedusha klal. Tashmish v'tash does not have kedusha at all. So in the dir show he brings. Are you allowed to put a piece of paper with your name in it in your tefillin bag? So how do we view a tefillin bag? Is a tefillin bag servicing the tefillin, or is it servicing the little boxes that the tefillin are in? So he brings that if the tefillin are always covered in its box, then the tick is a tashmish to tashmish, and you can put something in it. I don't think we uh, I don't think we hold that way. I think we hold that um, tefillin bag is not just servicing the boxes, it's servicing the tefillin itself. Yeah, I think the tefillin bag, we say, is uh, servicing the tefillin, because you, you, it's not that you need a bag to put boxes in, you need a bag to put the tefillin in, it's just you also need boxes so that the corners don't get rubbed out. But Lamaisi brings another svara, that it's, uh, the name is for the tzarech ha tefillin, so they don't, they don't get lost, because uh, it's very hard to put on tefillin if you don't know where they are. Okay, now, Azmane, Afilu Bedibur Bavad, even with speaking alone. V'choshikin, in other words, if you do do Hazmana and you wrap it one time, V'choshikin, certainly, Im Netalai V'amar, if you took it and you said, Zayi Yelat Filan, Demahani, 
then the hazmana helps if you wrap it one time. Okay. Tfilin. Vitik shel talas. A bag for your talas. Loi mikri tashmish kedusha. It's not a tashmish kedusha. Rak tashmish mitzvah. Bechein mutter lahaniach by shar dvarm shachal. You can put whatever you want in your talas bag. People put, you want to put your Ezra's Torah calendar. You want to put your tabak. You want to put other illegal substances. Whatever you want to put in there, you could put in your talas bag. Da'af de munach by gamkein tixos. As you say, what do you mean? The tefillin bag is in there. No, that the talis bag is sir, the tefillin bag is tashmish kedusha. The talis bag for the tefillin bag is tashmish the tashmish. Loi have a tikshal talis kiim tashmish the tashmish. Vafilum nitein b'soicha siddur shaloi. Even if you put your siddur in the tefill in the talis bag, it's not a tashmish kedusha. Diyesh by Kedusha, the, the Siddur has Kedusha. Now, why is that? Why is a talis bag not considered Tashmish Kedusha if it has a Siddur? So in the Dershut explains that the truth is if it wasn't bound, then the bag would be a Tashmish Kedusha. But because the Siddur is bound... The binding is the Tashmish, and the bag is Tashmish to Tashmish. Even though we said, Legabe, bring it into a bathroom, or Legabe, Tashmish Hamita, you, it's not considered a cover. It's, it's Guf HaSefer. Le'inyin Kedusha, Tashmish Kedusha, it is considered a cover. Now, even if you put in the tefillin without a bag. Nevertheless, you could still put um, stuff in your talus bag. Because at the end of the day, it's made also for the talus. The talus is an item which is chayl, vavakilu hisna, and it's like you stipulated. See, my boys, you know, they like to put their siddur in their tefillin bag. So I always tell them, when you put your tefillin in the bag, make a stipulation, you're using the bag for whatever you want. So then they could put their siddur in the tefillin bag without a problem. That's uh, Sif Bez. Hisna Alehem. If you're Masna, you can even make Shal Roshan to Shal Yad. So certainly you could be mash, uh, Masna on a Tashmish of uh, Kedusha. If you could be Masna on uh, Etzem HaKedusha, you definitely could be Masna on Tashmish Kedusha. Now, V'oysen Ho'anoshem HaHochem Adach. Those people who travel. U'mishtamshem B'sak Shal Tun B'dvam Shachal. And they use their Tfilin bag they put their toothbrush in there. They put their pajamas in there. After Medina Asr, even though it's Asr Midin, because you can use a Tashmish Shal Kedusha for a, a, a secular item. Why? Since they're accustomed to doing it, it's as if they were masked in the beginning. By the way, again, we see. But if they were master in the beginning, it's certainly okay. It's not correct to do this. Because it's not nice to have your pajamas together with your tefillin. Now, look in, in the Dirshu, note 14. What do you do with an Arayin? When, is an Arayin... Tashmish Kedusha, or is an Arayin Tashmish to Tashmish? Um, he says, even though an Arayin, you only put it in a Sefer Torah when the Sefer Torah is in its tick, it's not Tashmish, it's not it's Tashmish Kedusha, and you ha- it requires Geniza. I would say that's Pashat, because even the tick, I mean, if it's a Svardi tick, so it's the Tzavita is already protected. So then you can make the case, maybe the Aron is Tashmish, but in our, our cloth, so the Sefer Torah, 
you need the safe, right, if it's fireproof. It's not protecting the, the matpachas around, it's protecting the, the Sefer Torah itself. It's Pasha, it's Tashmish Kedusha. Okay. Let us, we're going to call it a break here, and then we're, we're going to read Sivkat and Yid Beis, okay? So we're just going to pause. You've just experienced another Torah class, brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.